Hello, this is the fourth video for the Least Weasel Project. Here I'm going to show you what to do with your traps, you know, after you've, uh, you've gone out and trapped and hopefully got some weasel hair. Probably one of the first thing you guys uh, noticed when you were putting your traps out or taking them in is that having a drill driver can make this whole process go easier. Uh, I can't send you a drill driver, but if you have one or you can borrow one, it's a lot easier to put the screws in and take them out with a, with a driver. Another thing you probably noticed is that seeing white hairs on a white background is kind of tough. A couple of you have already pointed this out. I can't get ones with a black background. So the next best thing is that you go collect your, your samples or collect your traps, bring them back to your, your house and have a look at them there because you're going to have to rebate them anyway. And so what I've also done is tied the ribbon that was out on the trap out in the, in the bush with the trap number on it on it so that way I know it corresponds to which trap on my data sheet. So you can see here here's my data sheet filled out. On this I have uh, the habitats, the, the, the trap numbers and this is trap number six and I think I got some hair on it. There were small weasel traps pre tracks present. I marked that down and I took so I've taken this back now to the uh, the shop to have a look inside. So now that I've got it apart, the easiest thing to do is take your tape off. pliers. So I've taken the, the tape off of the unit and now I'm just going to snip the tie wire and slide it through. And you can see on the sticky pad some gray and black hairs from my head. So we need to cover those up because if you slide that in an envelope, it's just going to stick to everything. So you've got these little strips of paper in your kit. And you just lay them over top of the sample. I have also filled out a, uh, a card for this. So it has my name on it, the date, the transect letter, so transect A, and trap six. So now this corresponds back to my data sheet. Now this, all we have to do is save it in a dry spot until the end of the project. And then this, along with your data sheets and traps and gear, will all get sent back to me and uh, I'll send them off for analysis. It'll probably take about six months and uh, for everyone who's involved in the project, I'll send you back a little synopsis of how well we all did and how well your particular transect did, including uh, you know, where you found least weasels and where you didn't.